All right. Hey guys, Coach Chris, a uh, very quick Ironman transition bag tip. When you're dropping off your bags, and especially if it looks like there's gonna be rain overnight or during the race, how to keep your stuff dry. So one of the main tips I do is Ziploc bags. So I put my running shoes in a completely separate, fully sealed Ziploc bag. So my running shoes will always be dry when I get back to transition put those in the bag, and then all my other transition gear I put in one giant Ziploc bag. And so once I put my shoes on, I just grab this and I walk. And while I'm walking, I take things out and put them on. So I'm saving time, not sitting in one place in transition, and all my items will also be dry. So that double Ziploc bag trick is great. Um, I also put an extra Ziploc bag in um, just so that I can put any of my wet stuff in. If I'm coming off the bike and I don't want to mix items or whatever, but this can also double as an extra um, bag I can use to protect my gear. So one quick tip you can do when you drop your bag off with the strings, take the strings, fold the top of the bag over. So first, we'll just tie these tight, then roll the bag over and tie them again, sealing the top is like a little bit of a knot. And that way, if it rains, the rain will go down around the side. It won't really get into the bag. So this is a great way to keep your entire bag nice and sealed. You can test it by pushing against it to see if any air comes out. It should be pretty relatively airtight. If you want to go next level, you can even go further and take a bag like this, put this over the top of that, and then get another little piece of string and put that over, create a whole other balloon over the top to really go crazy with it, duct tape it, whatever you want to do. Um, but that would be a little extreme. I don't think you need to do that. So if you don't have an extra bag, just roll this over and then tie it again. And that way, hopefully, it'll be easy to open still, but it'll also be much more sealed. Give that a shot.